Hey there, Ulti Zeta here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon. In the last episode, Tora and I did Roundhouse Sprawl, and in this episode, I am all by myself, because he went to go... He went... He went long when we were, went to go play catch, and I haven't seen him since. Someone should file a missing persons report or something. Anyways, play catch! Well, we recovered the missing minute hand, but the hour hand is still missing. I detected some signals in the clockwork's court, so let's start our search there. Luigi, just the man I wanted to see. Not that we have a choice, being stuck here in the bunker together and all. Anywho, I tried my darndest, but I wasn't able to locate that missing hour hand. The periscope can only find paranormal objects, so we're out of luck there. However, I was, while I was searching, I found some minor paranormal signals in the clockwork's court. That's probably just a few greenies, but we have to start our search somewhere. You ready? Prepare to be pixelated! And son, you don't need to cower in fear every time I pixelate you. It's perfectly safe! You've done this over a dozen times without anything going wrong. Alright, I'm gonna push the button now. Don't go cowering in fear this time, you hear? Sorry, Egad. It's his only animation. You can't stop him. And coincidentally, it's a few greenies, but hey, look! Remember what I said last time? Even, even his fellow ghosts don't appreciate him. So, like I said, Holter Pup missions, they exist. While I was surprised that, you know, we didn't get the Holter Pup in the first to eat the thing. Fact remains, he is still here. And he is still going to be annoying. No question about that. Money! Wow, that was a lot of money. Go away, bug. I'm really curious where the hell, like, the first gem is, because we still don't have that thing. And, like, I don't know where it's supposed to be. But whatever. Alright, well, it's a Polter Pup mission, so. This guy's got infinite health for some reason. Oh, because now they're shielded or something. I didn't really remember that was a thing, but I guess it is. Alright, where'd the dog go? We know how this works. He's in here. Oh. And he went upstairs. So, guess that's where we're going. As soon as I get this frowny face of money. Let's go get some money. Yada yada yada. Are we gonna be falling down? No. That's nice. Hey, we got a gold bone. Still haven't needed that yet, but I'll take it. Alright. Now, we're over here in the drafting offices. And the dog's in here.
So we never did get to go this way. So at least this Polterpup mission is taking us on a quest through some different areas and stuff. Older pup went across the wall. Hi. What's your thing? And get you. Done. That was easy. Oh, so we're just on the upper floor of up here. There's no point, really. Alright, whatever. There's something in here? Oh, the dog. And he licks me. He goes that way. So we're not seeing new rooms, never mind. Well. We're doing this again. All for a dog. Look at him. Look at him. Look at his face. And I went in here. The area we were just at. This thing still falls down. So we can't just walk all the way over there. Okay. Okay. Let's grab both of you guys. Because he's got a red shield, which means that we have to use red power in order to suck him up. Look into this. Oh, this is just letting me see the kiln room. I don't really care about that. Well, I do notice there's a door back here. Uh, into nothing. Okay. There's probably like a secret in the la in the last mission. I really wish Luigi just wasn't, like, always making shocked declarations of things. Because it would make this so much easier. This isn't... The reason why this sucks is just because it's not a puzzle. It's nothing. It's just going back through the rooms. It is literal padding. And so, in that regard, it's just not fun or engaging compared to the rest of the game. It's a waste of time. It would be vastly different if it took you through different rooms or made you do different things in those rooms. But it's just go chase the poltergeist, polterpop, and that's it. Nice work. The ghostly dog actually did us a favor. I'll bring you back in a second. That was a quick mission though at least, so I can definitely do the next one. I did it! I did it! Walter, puppy's annoying! Seven minutes. Seven minutes was all I could spare to play with that dog. I did not find a boo, though, which does mean that I am going to not get the bonus mission. Which I actually have not mentioned. If you get all the boos in the in the ma in each of the missions of the mansion, you unlock a special bonus mission in that mansion, which basically just has you going around, running through the mansion, collecting ghosts. 
I only ever did one of them in my own personal playthrough where I beat the game. And I never bothered to do it since, because it's just not super interesting. Hand over that power hand, here you go. Dog didn't chew it up. I was worried I'd have to repair it. Alright, you know the drill. Let's send those ghosties down to the vault. Do do dee dee do. Do 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 And once again, we fail to keep the ghost dog where it needs to be. And it's the same cutscene as before. Because it's friggin' batting. Dog on it, not again. We need the rotor. Now I gotta track it down. You hear me, young feller? Skedaddle! I'll, how about I skedaddle to the next mission? Peace at last! We think he knows where it is. It's, there's one more piece, and Lu you gotta think he knows where it is. That's what I didn't read. We both have clock now, so we need to find a rotor. And we'll be able to fix the gate. The dark moon piece is still up there. We gotta hurry. It's picking up a lot of ghostly activity. Which makes me think that they're hiding the rotor there. Ghosts have that area on lockdown, but I have a few trips up my sleeve. There's another pixelator camera in the area, so all I have to do is hack it and adjust the destination. Maybe you'll even catch the ghost soft guard. Here's a picture of the rotor. Keep an eye out for it. Right, youngster? Give him what for? I have a feeling we're gonna be meeting our old friend in this episode. Because he fell down a cliff in the first mission, and we haven't seen hide nor hair of him. So, we gotta fix that. Well, uh, here, a sparkly fellow. We're in the service elevator. Service elevator, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that thing broke. Also, yep, this is where our friend just decided to die. Gear chamber. This chamber really grinds my gears. You can kind of see how this mission is going to be wrapping, wor working out, but, though, because, yeah, we're going to have another toad in this one. Come on, Luigi, just zap him! Now we know that the thing is over there, probably. Oh, but now we don't get to see. That's rude. And Egad says, we need to get you inside that storage room. Why didn't I think of this earlier? I hired a toad assistant to look up the old clockworks. Apparently he went to check on a malfunction in the synchronization room. I can't believe I forgot about him. Working, working for me must be really terrible. Probably. But yeah, there's a toad in this, and so eventually we're gonna have to bring him all the way to where, all the way to the back to the beginning, because, you know, we're gonna need to pixelate him out of here. Well, that thing fell down. But hey, look, here's some money. Maintenance hub. Well, you see, now we have new rooms and areas and places to explore. We do need, however, a key. So... Oh, nope, I missed. Give me a 
anything. We're inside of it, so it's like, nope, I'm not gonna spawn in yet. Okay, we got a gem. That's useful. Dee 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 doo. Right, this will spring us up. I see. Dee 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 doo. Now I can go this way. Because we gotta get a key. And there's cranks in this room. Get it? They're cranky ghosts. So cranky. Okay. That guy just immediately exploded. Okay. I do it. I do it. Now everything's moving. As it should. Not really much any of anything over here, though. Oh, okay. Can't go that way. Oh, that there's a gold greenie up there. Well, that's good to keep in mind. Yeah, we got a gold bone. Yay. This might end up being a bit of a long episode, by the way. I'm just not gonna bother either of those two. Hey, buddy. I can't see any of the money he let left out, but... I mean, it's probably there, right? Ah. Oh. Hmm. Is there any way for me to, like... Nope, okay. Well. BRB! Okay, time to wreck these two. Ow! He really wanted to read the news. He was very upset at me. And how here we have another gold greenie. Look at all this money. Diddly 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 do. Okay, well, we got ourselves the key we need, so now we can go all the way back.
Okay. Now that we can go through here, let's get ourselves a toad and move on with life. That is an awesome cuckoo clock. Okay. And there's our friend, and there's a spider. Should be good enough. They're in the synchronization room. Synchronization. Oh. Hi, I've been synchronized. Luigi, the Luigi. Ah, um, it's not hard to finally meet you, sir. I'm a huge fan. Huh? The professor sent you to rescue me? I was sure you'd forgotten about me. Oh, you're looking for a way to access the storage room? Sure, let's go take a look. But first, there's something you should know about me. I, I have an irrational fear of clocks. Please don't laugh. Just get me away from any large clocks or gears, okay? Man, this place gives me the creeps. Come on. But for some reason, he got sent to work here. Alright. Let's go. Never mind. You gotta get a red shield. Bam! Now you're both broke! Give me your money! Alright. Thanks for being slow. Slow me down. Choof! So we shoot him there while Cuckoo Clock takes us back this way. Rude! I had a plan, you squandered it. Alright. Come on. Come on, Toad. Doo -doo -doo. All right. Well, bring it on, buddy. Let's just get these guys out of here and over with. Toad, everything's fine. Toad, everything's fine. Come on, come on. We're going this way. All right, hold on first. I gotta get some money. Toad. Toad. It's 
just a spider. Calm yourself. Oh, hello, buddy. So these are the guys that hid the thing from us. These shovel guys are always really annoying because you can't really get them easily in a group. Hit me. Buddy, are you gonna, like, do anything? Okay. Come on. Okay. Again, it's all pretty cut and dry stuff. I don't have anything much to say, it's just catching ghosts. It's basically kind of a replacement of how the last Toad mission, you know, had the... Uh, sisters. But this one now just has these guys in a little weird pseudo boss rush thing. Hold on, Toad. Okay, now I can finally go after this guy. Gotcha. So now these guys have more health because he's, uh, he's all shiny and stuff. But didn't stop him from dying. He taught that ghost a lesson. He looked different from the other ghosts. Let's hope he didn't hide that rotor too well. First. Come on. All right. I want to see what's up here. Cause this door is freaking out. All right, red coin mission. All right, I see where I need to go. Cause these make you go bounce. Yay! Oh, we got a gem from that. I didn't know gems could even be from those. Okay. I do it. I do it. Okay. Now that I'm back, and Toad is still crying because I left him. Come on. We gotta go up this way. Hmm. So do I just shoot him up there? Is that like what I'm supposed to- Oh, okay, there we go. I was gonna say, like, where's the target? But 
There's the target. All right, so now we know the thi the goat thing is is in here. So we just gotta find it. Not in there. Something seems to be hidden. There it is in there. So what we gotta do is shoot Toad. Bloosh. Good job, Toad. You done it. Ah! I can't believe I touched that clock rotor. I feel sick. Now that you got what you came for, can you take me back to the service elevator? There's a pixelator screen in there. I can't wait to get out of this place. I can't wait to not do the to Toad voice again. Be because it hurts my throat, but I must suffer for my craft, as with all art. Come on. As like all artists. <laughs> all right. Come on. So we're basically done here. But we can get that gem and all this money. That's what you were sacrificing me for? A gem? My life really means that little to you. Okay. And with that. I'm Toad! Oh. <laughs> and now we're done. Huzzah! Dee 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 do. Thanks for rescuing my Toad assistant. He's very eager to see his fellow Toad. And nice work tracking that rotor down. Hold on a sec, I'll bring you back. We have basically seen all there is to see. With the exception of the boss, which we will get to in the next episode because this has already been a bit of a longer one. Sorry about that, but I got 2,000 gold, so it doesn't matter. Okay. All right, that went that went pretty 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 okay. I'm probably gonna guess this might be like I don't know 35 minutes, which is a bit long. So they might make the next episode just the boss and nothing else, because it's just, I don't know. Because yeah, that was a bit of a lengthy one. Fine work, you handled that well. Let's stuff these things in. Got a new gem, got a new gem, got a new gem. And got this guy. 2,000 gems, gold things, whatever. Words are hard. And you got what you got to say. That sneaker ghost you caught seems to be more powerful than the others, and he has strange marks all over his body. Peculiar. And anywho, just like the first toad, this toad couldn't tell me how he got trapped in the painting. He only remembers being chased by booze, then suddenly everything went black. However, he was very happy he could help you. He wouldn't stop bragging about it. But you're the real hero here, Luigi. Good job recovering that final clock part. Here it is. No, no, you keep it. You'll need it for the next mission. And then just Luigi just stuffs it in his pants. Even though it's too big. We're finally ready to open the clock tower gate and climb up to the top. But first, here's something we need to review. This toad also had a snapshot from my tri-dimensional camera security lab. It was taken pretty recently too. Hopefully it'll give us some useful information. I'll go ahead and process it now. Re let me know when you're ready to look at. Okay. Well. Next time on Let's Play Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, it's showtime! So, see y'all then. Yay. Nyoing.